Best of the Audis, 10th outright, second in class. What a fantastic day. Oh, it's fan it awesome for the team and everyone involved. It's uh, hard to believe that we've achieved what we've done today, considering the time that we've had to prepare for this event, um, the laps that we've all done in the car leading into this, and uh, yeah, absolutely over the moon. You've got a big year coming up. Did you enjoy getting a few laps under your belt, knocking the rust off a little bit, getting ready for the season? Yeah, 100%. It's always good to get into that race simulation where you've got people around you and uh, trying to get into a rhythm and trying to do a long stint. So I really enjoyed that today. Obviously, it was quite hot, you know, especially towards the end of the day there, trying to do a double stint was really tough. So, um, yeah, no, it was a good, good job by everyone. You know, Roger and David did an exceptional job all day, kept the car clean and... You know, we both said at the start of the weekend that you know, all we want to do is finish the race and make sure that we bring the car home. We did that, picked up some silverware and uh, you know, we're all over the moon. It's awesome. And just another success for the Aussie Driver Search Program. You know, they've got this remarkable prize uh, on offer to come and race these cars and it's going to be here at Bathurst next year. Like, it's incredible. Oh, I think it's absolutely fantastic. It's no better way to kickstart that the new opportunity that's available, obviously, is that where you can win the drive to be racing in the 2020 Bathurst 12 hour, and now to show that you know it's a front-running car and to have that sort of opportunity really, I think, puts more more emphasis on what, what's available as a prize, and uh, I think it's really exciting, and yeah, can't wait to see how that all unfolds as the season goes on. Any day that ends with champagne at Bathurst is a pretty good day, I'd reckon. Yeah, the start of the day we wanted to keep it clean for 12 hours, and exactly what we did. The team did, did a great job. Dave did a great job, uh, Todd Hazelwood did a great job, uh, I kept my end of the bargain up as best I could and we get a result. Pretty warm one today, how did it feel out there? It wasn't too bad early, uh, my second stint was a bit easier for me, I actually didn't mind it, cool suit worked okay, had a bit of a drink and uh, it was fine. Finished on the podium at Bathurst, how good is that? Yeah absolutely, um, what a big day for us, it's the, the whole lead up for us was obviously um, as a working group the car getting prepared um, before and then having a chance to drive it literally for like 10 laps at Queensland Raceway before we arrived here so you think about where we started and you know where we're finished today it's um, been a massive effort uh, from Matt Stone Racing, um, Aussie Driver Search have um, then put in the car so um, for us we've battled all day not a mark on the car and um, it's been great Rog did a great job and uh, Todd did a great job as well, so it's, yeah, it's been great to be part of the team and then come away with some silverware. Matt Stone, 10th in the 12 hour today. Talk us through how it all went down. Yeah, look, it was really good. Uh, you know, our first time here running an Audi. Uh, we've been here with a GT3 two years ago with Aston Martin and uh, didn't end so well at about the five hour mark. So our goal was to finish and finish well. And, you know, we had a good team and a good crew and, yeah, we're really happy with the outcome. It's always nice when you get a bit of champagne at the end of it as well. Yeah, look, it's a long day on the back of a long week, so it's good to get rewarded at the end. You know, there's not many people get up on the podium, and there's a lot of people here trying.